yeah, quite a challenge, of course, in such large projects. So uh, we basically have uh, uh, many different teams, um, research teams that work on different things and they also follow very different methodologies and research strategies uh, and so on. So, and they follow research strategies that are usually not really, uh, that cannot be really well combined. Yeah? So there's, for example, design research, there's the, these empirical studies, ethnogra ethnography, there's more the technology development uh, and so on. So I think the, 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 the reason why um, scientific, overall scientific coordination is important is to, yeah, first of all, generate awareness of these different research strategies and what they, what their aim is and why they, they work the way they work. And then to establish these, yeah, I like to think of them as, as boundary objects that, that people can share between the groups and they can understand and that they uh, can take on board when they then progress their own work, so to say.